Okay. He once against the ghosty with uh, Indiana Jones and the fate of Atlantis. It's not operating. I don't think that'll work. Wonderful. Whoa! Yeah, there you go. This thing's got a motor. Hmm. It's closed. Let's pick up the different stones. Pick up. Keep end. It doesn't quite fit. How about the sunstone? Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. Moonstone then. I'll never get through here. Come on. Come on, walk. I look mock fabs. Look at chain. It's a chain through a loop of stone. Pick up chain. I can't lift the whole thing at once. Use chain with that's it yeah. kind of pull chain I can't move it Kiss. I can't see anything from down here let's uh, use ladder it's a ladder I said use ladder with I don't think that'll work no not the chain It's closed. Open. <laughs> no, no, for goodness sake. It's debris from the robot. I can't put it there. I can't put it there. this okay I'm going to take a picture of that okay use the moonstone use the moonstone it's a strange carving Okay, flute. Come on. I can't lay the crescent piece down flat. I can't put it there. I can't. Pick the spooked wheel. Pick that one. Right. Oh, there we go. It can't move anymore in that direction.
I said use. Goodness sake. Oh, for goodness sake. I can't pick it up. I'm already holding something. Shut up. Yep, boost force. Wait. This was a hinge pin that held up the door. Maybe you can use this to feast Sophia. Don't know why we would, but just in case, let's do so. Alright. Give a hinge pin to Sophia. <laughs> What am I supposed to do with this? Maybe we'll think of something. Open cage. What makes you think this is safer now? I've got a plan. Which is? Uh... Brace the cage with a hinge pin. You know, that just might work. There! You know, I had to slug you. Come on, Sophia, don't be angry. She was not being angry? Cool. You left me rotting in this hellhole! Well, if that's how you feel, maybe you should stay here. Yeah. Maybe I will. Great idea. Fine. Fine. Can we get moving oh, what was that I'm not sure I think Nurab Sol made me do it is that so dangerous moving? fella that mr. Sal yeah well we better be going Indy, mm -hmm. Nurab Sal is here. I sense his presence. Of course you do. Hold on a minute. Will you please stop with the hokum? Will you please stop with this hokum? Hokum? Are these walls hokum? These lights? Neither is the king who built them. Bullshit. Whoever built this place wasn't a spook. Muck me if you wish, fool. Oh, for crying out loud. In here, Indy. Follow me. Why should I? Ah, Dr. Jones. Welcome to my humble abode. It's a lava pit full of calcified skeletons. Can you use it just went there? On the other side. Hey. I hear you. Come on, Sophia, let's get out of here. Never! I'm staying right here with the spirit who guides my thoughts. Uh -huh. You're starting to make me nervous, kiddo. You're starting to make me nervous, kiddo. Don't fret, Indy. At last, Nurab Sal and I are one and the same! <sighs> sure, why not? Fine, if you promise not to foam at the mouth. 
You think you're so smart, but you understand nothing! Why are you acting like this? Why are you acting like this? Acting like what? Speak your mind, Carl! Come on, Sophia, get a grip on yourself. Yes. I am no longer the one you call Sophia. I am simply the, the one who rules! Mm-hmm. Whatever. Look at those feet, or whatever they were. It's a bronze rod, probably a king's scepter. It's a bronze rod, probably a king's scepter. Uh, can I use that with lava pits? I don't think that'll work. Mind if I look at your necklace? Uh, can I use that with the necklace? Ah! Ow! Pardon me. That medallion is hot! Drop it, why don't you? Nurab Sal won't let me! That medallion is hot! Use... No! Sorry, Sophia. So long, Nurab Sal. Hmm. Thanks, Indy. If you hadn't done that, I'd be as dead as that monster. Sophia. Yes? Come on, Sophia. Let's get out of here. Come on. Lead. Going up? I'll wait down here. Suit yourself. Looks like another hungry mouth. Hmm. Yeah, I thought I might need this back. I can't. It's wedged in too tight. Okay. Pick up. Uh, back to the... Um... All that. There's already something there. Hmm. Pull the... Come on. Use that with that. Aha! You! Fucking peg. Well, that looks much better. Use that with the thing. More or a calcum beads. Bloody well need them. Mm. Use that with I don't think that'll work. No, use with a fucking slot. Uh, 
Morgans. The other Morgans in the other corridor. It won't go up any further. Uh, don't know, like this. Uh, use as uh, oh, for fuck's sake. It's working. There we go. Get on board, Sophia. That was close. Indeed. Too close. Let's uh, walk this way. Okay, let's walk that way. Stick close, kid. This could be dangerous. I'll take my chances. Uh, I think I need to get down to here. I can't climb back up. The passage is too steep. I can't climb back up. The passage is too steep. That's back where we came. Where's Sophia anyway? Yeah, she is. Hey! What? I can't climb oh, back up. The passage is too steep. I think we need to get down to this passage here. Even though, even though it's not, not that hard to get to. Whoops! Why is Sophia just standing there? <coughs> do, do. Sophia. We're beyond the fucking graphics. What's this one?
Are you coming? Hold your horses! Nice moves. Thanks. Here's your shining city. Not what I expected, that's for sure. <laughs> and the place is still humming. Maintaining the air pressure for untold centuries. Yet, move your nose, I suppose. Hungry for Oracalcum. Let's use Oracalcum with the frog statue. Hmm, that didn't do anything. Oh, we probably need a place of these on this spindle. That didn't do anything. Still nothing. Turn it on. You see, Colonel? I told you Jones would be of some use to us. Kerner, I knew I smelled a rat. Indeed. All I smell at dogs is your fear. Don't move. Mein God, how beautiful! Congratulations, Dr. Jones! You've just handed the Third Reich its ultimate victory! It'll take more than a few orichalcum bombs to conquer the world, Uberman. Bombs? The gods don't need bombs. Take a look around. What do you think this astonishing machinery was used for? Well, that's a mystery we'll never unravel. Wrong! As Plato himself well knew, this was a factory for manufacturing higher beings! While you've been wandering around, we've been stockpiling orichalcum. And now we have all we need! Are you ready for the greatest moment in history, Doctor? Didn't you notice all those hideously deformed bones? Experiments gone awry! Unworthy slaves sacrificed in the name of knowledge! Progress has its price, you know! Maybe they were all too human like you. Maybe they weren't quite as quite human to begin with. Maybe they weren't quite human to begin with. <laughs> and human or subhuman? They were destroyed by their physical imperfection, and they based in the awesome power of this device. Fortunately, we suffer from no such imperfection. Yeah, sure. 
I think the heat is cooked your cabbages. I think the heat in here has cooked your cabbages. Scientific discoveries belong to the board, Charles. That's something you of all people should understand. Uh, you really believe in this godhood business? Why not? As a god, I shall know everything, be everywhere, rule everyone. We both shall rule him, Doctor. Eh? Don't be silly, Colonel. You're not prepared for this. We shall see. Yes, well, simply pushed it from Valhalla. Eh? Eh? Tell you what, let's all go home and die in bed. We are scientists, we can't live. We must test the machine. And you'll make a fine volunteer. No! What? If anyone's going to become a god, it must be me. You don't make me laugh. I am in charge of this operation, you spineless sausage. Activate the machine. Mm-hmm. <sighs> A test is a test. Great or suggested can be. Let's try that. Wait. What now, Charles? <sighs> what about Plato's tenfold error? What about it? <sighs> it... I think. I think Plato prescribed an oracalcum overdose. Hmm. Just a thought. Maybe right. They should divide by ten. Try one bead. One bead it is. Himmel, it's working. Yep, definitely works. No! A small bead for a small man, eh, Charles? Now it's your turn. Yeah. He don't need also. He need a miracle. Godhood for egomaniacs like you. No, unless you want my men to murder you. That's better. Uh. What makes you think you can outdo the old king? Science, my boy. We have it and say it didn't. Here goes. Hang on a second. If Plato was out with the other one. Yeah. Listen, what if Plato's error went the other way? How do you mean? I want to go all the way. Divide by ten didn't mean. Well, didn't work, but multiply. I think Plato and Kerner were both wrong. All right, Chon, you decide. How many beats should be used? Who cares how many beats? It's all a myth. In that case, let's try Plato's suggestion. Eight, nine, ten beats. Indy, no! Mm -hmm. 
After Indy's fatal transformation, Atlantis shook itself to pieces, sealing its secrets and Nazis in molten lava. Well, not quite the outcome I wanted, but that's an ending, I suppose. So until next time, ladies and gentlemen, games for cans, you best make it because I will be back for breakfast. Farewell. So well.